It would be a lot easier if they had it, if they had it so the camera was pointed at you, was like directly behind you, like with, like with the rest of the game. But, oh well. Then again, well, some of the sections would be, other, other sections of it would not be. Can I go around? Come on. Both of you be good boys, okay? Be the best boys. Okay, here we go. I'm not gonna go overhead, that's too risky. I'm just gonna go past like this. Alright, and then there's... Alright, come on. Yeah, really starting to wish I uh, checked to get rid- to leave this section out of it. Oh well. Oh well, too late now. Can't do anything about it. I'll just stay over here. Come on, there we go. Thank you. And then run over to Princess Zelda. Come on. Come on. And what did we get? Okay, well, Zelda's letter. Okay, yeah, we, we first we gotta go talk to Impa to get the song. What song? Oh, okay. Oh. I thought I... I thought I had it so that... Okay, well, I guess... I guess I accidentally made it so that the songs are mixed in with the items in terms of randomization. So instead of getting any song, we just got a bloopy. Lovely. So that means that any potential chest or item in this game could be a song. Oh god, that terrifies me. Anyways, I'm gonna head to the, uh... So now that we've met with Zelda, we can go to the Kokiri Forest and, uh, talk with Saria. And learn... Well, normally we would learn a song, but I, just whatever, whatever happens. We could get a song. We could. But we could also, but it could also just uh, be, but it could also just be a, uh, it could also just be an item. It could just be a bloopy, in fact. Or, or it could be the light arrows. That's possible. It could literally be anything. I guess this counts as night time. So, yeah. Oh well. Uh, anyways. Uh, let's see here. No, wait, it's up here, right? Yeah, Lost Woods are up there. Alright, come on. Alright, up I go. Alright, now we go through the Lost Woods. Alright, here we go. I believe it's this way first. Nope, not yet. Okay, and then this way. Yes, yes. Then, wait, it's this way, okay. And then it is this straightforward. And then left, and then up. 
Or right. Yeah. Right. And... Yep, now we're back here. The sacred forest meadow. Get to go through it all again because I didn't realize before that you need to talk with Zelda first. Alright. There we go. Come on. Boom. Nice. 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 Okay. Come on, get over here. Yeah. Dead. Phew. Wait, I don't have my sword drawn. Oops. Wait, what? <gasps> oh no! Oh no! The sound for being almost dead is Navi. Oh no! Uh, I didn't mind her before, but we got a heart. At least that stops Navi. Thanks, Surya. Saria. Ugh. Oh, I'm going. I'm. Oh, now I never want to lose. <laughs> now I never want to lose hearts again. All because of friggin' Navi. Or screaming. Hey, look, listen. Hey. Oh God. There's a gossip stone. Alright, and then through, alright, now we leave the Lost Woods again, and then we head up to Kukiri Forest, or not Kukiri Forest, Kakariko Village. We're already in Kukiri Forest, what am I talking about? Oh wait, that's still the Great Deku Tree. This way is to leave. Alright, come on. Let's go to Mexico. Alright. Screw you, style kids. Or style children. Off to Death Mountain. Actually, first, we're gonna do a couple side quests in, uh... We're gonna do a couple things in... In uh, Kakariko. And then we go to Death Mountain. Wait. That's Tazora's Domain. Which we need the, um. We need the, uh. I think it was Zelda's Lullaby that we need in order to get into. Uh, into Zora's domain, which I don't have, and that and it's funny because uh, I don't know. I I might have said this earlier in the video, but uh, when I was doing my stream of this game, I got I got uh, both Zelda's lullaby and uh, hang on, I'm actually gonna wait for it to be day. I actually got both Zelda's lullaby and um, Saria's song, where you're normally supposed to get them. And so I thought that I accidentally like turned off the song randomization, and th but then I went to go get um, I went to go get uh, I went to go get Apona song, and I think it gave me the uh, I think it gave me the Requiem of Spirit. I can't remember, but it was it was funny. Like, what are the odds? Never tell me the odds. Wait, is it? It still counts as nighttime. Okay. Even though it's morning, it's still nighttime, apparently. So, just wait out here for a few more. 
All right, here we go. Oh! Oh! Anyways, uh, chicken. All right, we're going to go and do uh, Anju's little cuckoo task. Pick it up. Pick it up. Thank you. Because she normally gives us a heart piece for that, but because heart pieces are also part of the randomization, hmm. there you go. So, Anju's over here. I also find it funny how Anju, of all, of all characters, is one of the only characters who, who uh, keeps their name between Ocarina of Time and Majora's Mask. Because she's still, she's called Anju in both, um, in both games. I find that weird. It could just be me, though. Okay. Uh, I'll actually, before we start with the uh, friggin' um, Anju thing, we are going to wait. Oh yeah. Hang on. Wait. Wait. No. Get off. Link. Why? No. Ah, this controller is so finicky. No. Hang on. Wait. There we go. All right. Now you're free to go, chicken. And I'll go and get you later. But first, we're going to climb up this tower here. Climb on. Come on, Link. Climb. It's right. Thank you. Okay. <clears throat> and the reason for that is if I go right up here. And then I can... Nope, I just missed it. I almost I just barely missed it. Hang on. This up here could be the hook shot. Who or it could be the fairy bow. Or it could be literally anything on that on that list here. Or even some things that aren't on that list. Like Oh. Okay, we just we just okay. We just Barely made it. Okay, so what do you got for me, bro? Ooh, the Megaton Hammer. That opens quite a. That opens a lot. Holy crap! And and I'm saying that looking at the map tracker. I don't just know that. I am unfortunate. I am unfortunately not knowledgeable in this in very much. Oh wait, there's Grotto here. What's in this grotto? I'm not knowledgeable enough in this game to see what to know, to just know what all that opens up. Why did my controller... Okay, that was weird. Anyways, let's see what's in this bucket, or in this, uh, not bucket. The Song of Time! Nice! No, wait, uh, The Song of Time is that one. Yeah. Alright. Current, we can't actually, actually wait, we can do that with, we can do things with that with adult, for adult Link, so, yeah. But as Child Link, we can't actually use the Song of Time. So, yeah, that's kind of sucks, but oh well. Okay, I'm gonna throw that one over. Thank you. And then I'll come up. Come on, get down. Okay. Ah, sun, sun flares or lens flares—that's what they're called. I was—I I was trying to combine lens flare and solar flare, and it just became sun flare. <laughs> right into the cuckoo pen. Will I make it? Yes, I will. Okay. Alright. Chickens are annoying. I don't know why I don't know why she likes them. They're so annoying. Wait. Oh wait, hang on. I need to go uh Wait, did the one in here go back? 
It did. Okay. Oh yeah, because I because when I go into the grotto everything resets. That's right. Okay. So now I'm gonna use this. I'm gonna use you chicken. Because I need you for something. I need you to bring me right over here. No? Okay. Alright, well, looks like I need to go higher, faster, stronger! I knew but stronger. Okay. I think maybe me jumping off of here will do, but I could be wrong. We'll see. It, it, it gets me closer, but it, I don't think it would actually do good. I think I have to jump off the roof. Remember, kids, jump off the roof. Yeah. Oh, no. Game over. Yeah. <laughs> Wouldn't it be funny if, like, whenever you died in this game, it actually played the game over. Yeah. Thing. I think that would be funny. But I'm weird, so. Come on. Yes! Alright, so now. Off you go. Okay. Okay. And I think... And I think this... I think this one over here is the last one. But I might be wrong. Get over here. Thank you. Also, don't attack the cuckoos. Everyone knows that. I don't know why I tried to say anything about that. Just don't attack cuckoos. If you don't know about it, um, okay, wait. Okay, there's two more. There's two more hiding around somewhere. Um, I think there's one up here. Um, here, where, where else? Where else are there chickens? Oh, there's one up there. Oof. Okay. Yeah. I don't know how long I've been recording for, so what I think what I think I'm gonna do is I'm just going to uh I s I'm I'm just going to do that thing where like I record really long sessions and then I cut and then I cut it up in editing. I feel like that'll make things easier on myself. Yeah. Okay. And then there's one more. Hmm. I kind of feel tempted to do the uh, infinite sword glitch and try and get myself down into the well early. But I'm. I've never been any good at the infinite sword glitch. I always just end up uh, breaking the sign. <laughs> if you don't know, the infinite sword glitch basically lets you, uh, you have to do, you need to do a crouch. You need to, you need to, uh, lock onto someone. Hang on. Oh. Okay. Well, that was pointless. But basically, what you need to do is you need to uh, you need to crouch. You need to do a crouch stab and then inter and then interrupt the crouch stab with a uh, with a with by uh, either looking at a sign by by uh, reading a sign. It's best to do on signs like this that are uh, unbreakable. Actually, I, I think that sign's unbreakable. I might I might be wrong though. So I crouch and. I crouch and then I stab read. Nope. Stab check. Oh, I did it! Oh, sweet. Okay. So it it also locks the camera. So yeah. So I can't remember exactly. Okay, so that did it. So that fixed the camera. So I can't remember how. I can't remember how you're supposed to. Uh, I can't remember exactly what you're supposed to do, but yeah. So I, I successfully managed to do the infinite sword glitch. 
and uh, basically, basically, if I walk up to anything with my sword right now, it'll just continue attacking. Basically, it's in a, an attack state constantly, and it's undone whenever I hit the attack button. So I'm gonna, I'm actually gonna try to do it again, cause I'm surprised I managed to do that. Nope. Nope, I didn't do it. Okay, let's try that again. Man. <laughs> All right. Ah, oh, crap. Nope. Put that. Put that away, Link. Put it away. Hang on. So, come over here. Crouch. Stomach check. Nope. Stomach check. I didn't even. I didn't even... Yeah. No. Aha! Oh, nice. I'm actually able to do the um. I'm actually able to do the infinite sword glitch right at somewhat regularly now. Sweet. Alright, come on. Get off, Link. Oh, yeah, see? Anything I touch. Anything I touch, um, instantly. Uh. I think I just have to, uh. I just have to, like. Or maybe, like, start. Nope. Come on. Come on. I managed to do it before. Come on. Okay, whatever. Okay. Not worth it. Not worth it. Uh, but yeah. I can do a lot with the infinite sword glitch. Now that I'm able to do that. Now, am I going to do anything with that? Probably not. But, I could. But it's all really difficult. Like, that's, that's one of the easier glitches, and I had a lot of trouble trying to get that down. Uh, I'm going to just show this to this guy, so that um, I can get it. Oh, yeah. Alright, so that activates the, uh, that activates the um, Happy Mask side quest. So that I can, uh, so I can do that later. So yeah. Hang on, wait, there's a, there's a, hang on, I'm gonna try and do, uh, yeah, I'm gonna try and do the infinite sword glitch with this sign here. Nice. Alright. Come at me. Ah, crap, it didn't work. Okay. Well. Ah, crap. Just end my suffering. Just, yeah. Thank you. Uh, well, you know what? I actually think that's a good time to uh, call it quits. So I'm going to save it. And... Game saved. Oh. No, don't. Crap, I didn't want to do that. Oh, well, too late now. Anyways, so... Thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you tomorrow. Or next time, whenever I do this. See ya.